Hey guys, it's Colleen from Best Dress for Less Kids Consignment Event. I wanted to make this quick video to show our consigners what to do if your tagging gun gets a jam. Um, I've had a couple of consigners uh, over the past two days email me because uh, they've said, oh, I just started using my tagging gun. I just took it out of the box. I used it for a half an hour and it's broken already. Um, I just wanted to say that I have had this gun for 10 years and it has jammed many, many times, but it has never, ever broken. And so this is how you fix your gun. So basically the way your tagging gun works, let me make sure I have it locked in. Okay, the way your tagging gun works is that there is a needle, this is the needle, and there's a track, see the track that goes right up the middle of the needle and into the plastic part of the gun, and you feed the barbs in there. And so when you click the trigger, it's gonna push a barb all the way out the end like this, through the clothing, and attach the tag. But what happens is sometimes these little pieces of plastic from the end get broken off inside of the needle. So like this is the little end, can get broken off inside of the needle and it can jam the gun. And so what you wanna do if that happens is if you look at this side of your gun, there's a little lever right here. You just turn this and it unlocks the needle. So turn it like this and then you can pull the needle out. And if you look closely, you'll see one side of the needle has a track. It's the only place that has a line in it where it's opened. And then you just take a big safety pin and you run it through the center of the needle and you can even put it here in the end and that will get whatever's in there out. It will clear the jam. And then all you have to do is put the needle back in your tagging gun and just make sure that the track in the needle is lined up with the track in the gun. Let me line mine up. Okay, and so you'll see on mine, it lines up. And remember, this is really important to turn this little thing back and lock it again, because if you don't, this needle will come shooting across the room and you could get hurt. So I'm gonna test mine real carefully, okay. So mine is now locked back in and let's see if it works now. So I'm gonna shoot. And see, there you go. You can see the barb is coming back out of the end of the gun and the jam is cleared. And so always put the tip back on so you don't stab yourself if you're not using it. Um, that is how to clear a jam from your tagging gun. One more thing. Sometimes when you get to the end of a stack of barbs like these and there are only a couple left, they get kind of bent up and they don't feed so well. If you're having problems feeding them through, maybe because you didn't keep your barbs stored someplace where they're nice and flat and neat, you can, um, like say you're feeding them through this way and they're getting jammed, pull this out and put it in the other direction. That's another good trick for keeping it from jamming. So, okay, so that's how to clear a jam. One more time, I'll show you. There's a lever on the end right here, this little one. You're gonna turn it. You're gonna pull this needle out. Let me pull harder. Sometimes it's a little hard to get out. There you go, pull it out. Take a safety pin, put it in the end, and sometimes you need to run it through the track like this. There's a little line that goes down it. I should have put my glasses on. Okay, so you run it down that line, and then that will clear the plastic out, and then you just line it back up so that the opening is next to the opening here. Slide it back in all the way turn this lever again to lock it in and then you can put a new thing of barbs in and you'll be good to go so that is how to clear jam let's say okay all fixed okay so that's how to clear jam from your tagging gun hopefully you won't have any jams tonight but i know there's going to be some serious tagging going on in the next 24 to 48 hours before drop off happens and before drop off drop off finishes so good luck everyone see you soon